All right, today we started throwing a small a small uh, jig today. Caught this nice nice bass. Really thick. It's definitely a female on a bed. I'm gonna release them. There she goes. So I started today off pretty good. I caught that really nice bass. It's probably about like maybe like a pound or two. It was really fat. It's definitely a female on its bed because I saw it moving around on the real shallow when I cast it over there. And I caught it on this little jig head with a little uh, swim bait. So hopefully I can get a couple more uh, nice fish like that and hopefully some bigger ones. But one disadvantage I don't have, or a disadvantage I have, is that I don't know where any of the, the fish beds are in this lake. I haven't scouted it out that much. I didn't even know there was a bed over there. I just saw something pretty big splash and I cast it over there. But I don't know, I'll try a couple spots I have caught fish before. Maybe switch up. It's a lot of weeds already. But it is pretty it's starting to get pretty warm, so this is expected. There's a lot to talk about this uh, swim bait. I've gotten a lot of luck with it at other lakes. I have not tried it at this lake yet, but I'm going to assume it's going to do pretty good. Considering I've caught a, a lot of fish on this already. But that bass I just caught before is definitely the biggest I've caught on that swim bait. Might have to switch to floating jerk bait. There's a lot of weeds on the bottom. And look at that. I saw this out of the corner of my eye. What is this? Oh wow, it's a little chatterbait. That's really nice. Oh, the rust, the hook's a little, uh, little rusted, but I'll take it. Take whatever I can get. Last time I fished here, or the past couple times I fished here, I've done really good in this spot, but it's mostly a lot of panfish in this little, little area. But you never know. I fish this slow and fish it off the bottom and jig it, but there's just so many weeds. I don't think I can. I just gotta straight retrieve it. I'm at the next spot and I'm seeing some swirls up in these shallows. This this part of the this part of the lake is probably one of the most shallow shallowest parts, but these fish are probably pushing up more shallow to get this warm water. But it is pretty it's pretty uh, thick with algae, so I don't know how effective I'm gonna be.
Now all this algae is getting pushed to this corner. Definitely gonna have to move somewhere else. To use. I found a clear, find, found a clear spot. With a little bit less algae. Hopefully, it's something over here. Still using that, that little uh, jig head with the swim bait on it. Still is algae. There's something, looks like there's a fish on a bed over there. Yeah, I see a couple beds over here and I'm pretty sure I saw something swim around over them. I can't tell what it is, it might be a panfish. Right there. One more cast over there might change to it. Oh, there's a panfish over there. Yeah, there's definitely something. Look at that. Is that? That has to be a fish. It's moving. Yeah, there's something definitely over there. I'm switching over to. Jerk bait. I've had on this jerk bait, and there are some huge bass over here sitting on beds. I see them chasing all types of stuff. They're splashing like crazy. There's one here, and maybe one or two over there, but there's a lot more beds with. I can't tell if there's fish on them. Huge bass. I don't know where this one went because it's. But the thing with this bait is there's so much gunk. I don't know if I can get it through this. It might be windy, guys. Sorry about that. Wind's coming right at us. It sucks because it's pushing all the gunk. And my lure just went where I wanted to. Little mouse tail. Looks like a power bait mouse tail. That's cool. Looks like I saw something else under the bench.
and it's oh it's a little uh what these bobby bobber stoppers that's cool Something swiped at it. There we go. Got a fish. What is it? No, no, go to the tree. What is it? What is it? What is it? Holy crap. Look at this. Oh my god. Look at the size of this fish. Panfish. Oh my god. This is my this is my PB. Look at that. Oh my god. That thing is massive. That thing is I'm I'm lost for words right now. Look at that thing. Go. Wow. That was insane. Finally caught a fish on camera for you guys. I was a little worried there. I was hope I was thinking the sad thing I was thinking that I was gonna catch one on camera. And that one large mouth was gonna be my only fish of the day, but luckily I got that that uh, very nice bluegill. Let's see. 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 Let's see.